So, this episode definitely contained ponies, I think. There was Trisket and Glimmy, and I think they had to unpack a wagon. And there was like a manicure cannon thing? Not in that order, right? You know, I feel like it was exactly in that order. Oh, yeah! Yeah, yeah, I, I totally remember now. Okay, so. Look at so. Glimmy's been hiding out in a room for a few weeks, strengthening her wrist muscles, and twice oh. getting on her case oh. saying she really oh. needs to get laid. So she goes out for a nice hot facial, and she meets some blue bitch who enjoys getting her face spackled. It's, um, what's her name? Uh, tricks are for kids? Dixie Tulamu. Right, the crunk and plasterful tipsy. So Trixie and Starlight become friends. Or at least Starlight thinks they're just friends, but in reality, you know, Trixie's just hungry from some puh after a long trip from wherever, and what better way to get herself off physically and psychologically than to cuckold Twilight? God, that is disturbingly in character. Yeah, bro, this show's fucked up. I mean, in reality, Twiggles and Glimmer aren't together at all, but Trixie's so fucked up from everything Twilight and her friends put her through over the years that I don't think she understands reality anymore. Dude. Wow. Anyway, Tipsy has Glimmy to help her unpack her wagon, which is obviously code for smash my twat like a pumpkin. Fan artist, do your thing. And Twilight watches them oh, through yeah. a bush, and DJ Pony's like, Twilight, hey Twilight, you're creepy as fuck. Twilight, you need to get laid. Twilight. Then Trixel Pixel gets preggers, right? Nah, man. Yeah, that's how sex works. Uh, it doesn't work that way with chicks, okay? Go plow a biology textbook, then yourself, and come back to us after that. Okay, no joke, no scam. That's literally my fetish. Look, the magician horse gets into a fight with Glimmy, and Trixie decides to get drunk. Uh, however, she doesn't have any alcohol, money, or shame, so she drinks several bottles of cough syrup. The DXM, combined with her crippling depression, leads to a psychotic break in which she can't remember if... During the aforementioned wagon unpacking, Starlight was using a strap-on, or she actually had a dick. Trixie decides that it must have been the latter and reasons that she must be pregnant with a child that she'll now have to raise on her own, which is something that, seeing as she just drank multiple bottles of Robitussin, or whatever the go-to brand is in Equestria, even she knows she's not fit to do. Trixie decides to shoot herself out of a cannon, hoping that the concussive force will kill her, which seems like a desirable outcome in her current state of mind. What the fuck is wrong with you two? 